hi guys welcome to garden specialist channel today the topic of my video is leaf miner disease leaf miners these are the larvae of insects flies wasps beetles and and moths and these lines you are seeing on the leaves are the larvae that are feeding on the plant tissue between the surface of leaves they dig into the leaves and destroy the plant tissue and as a result leaf miner infestations make leaves to turn brown and fall and as a result if it is a fruiting and flowering plant then the fruiting and flowering is much less and uh, it is not a deadly disease until and unless we take care or just take care in the beginning or at an early stage and the most common method is to remove the leaves and correctly dispose of them and uh, the other method is to spray general pesticide on the infected leaves and if they are fruiting plant then the organic pesticide should be used and the plant uh, to save the leaves from this deadly disease and larvae are very large in number and they are uh, some uh, beetles and wasps and insects feed upon the, these larvae they are beneficial but how can we make them to destroy the larvae so we have to just spray organic pesticide and it is one is to one ratio of clove oil and neem oil both mixed together and, uh, and then lukewarm water should be added to mix to make a solution and uh, spray this solution on the leaves and you'll get rid of this of larvae and uh, this disease is more common in tomato plants and chili plants and many flowering plants and if uh, it is in initial stage and detected and uh, you uh, take precautions otherwise it will damage all the plants and the pesticide which I have told you is like a fertilizer and you can, you can spray as many times as you like if the oil and water is uh, in one one is to 10 ratio and this fertilizer you can spray every week and uh, you can keep all the pests and all the diseases away from your garden and this is a good fertilizer also fertilizer and pesticide for your plants and uh, it will never let your plant be damaged so it is a good formula you have to use everyone should use neem oil and clove oil in the garden and it uh, make a spray of it and uh, you can use uh, a mild soap solution instead of this lukewarm water then also you can use it and it will be very good for plants and your plants will be safe and will be benefit benefited by this pesticide so this disease will not come into you into your garden and your garden will be safe so happy gardening